welcome again youtubers welcome to toyota vits now in this video i would like to talk a little about why is it that we experience so much engine vibration in these three cylinder engines now for a three cylinder engine we realize that we are only operating on just three cylinders and what this means is that you have to complete four strokes in three cylinders and what this means for this engine is that the engine would have to rotate a little bit longer in order for what we want in terms of the power stroke so the power stroke is what propels the engine and keep it keep it going so in order for the engine to rotate we need that power stroke now that power stroke is going to take a little bit longer to occur because we're only using three cylinders now in a four cylinder engine the power stroke is much closer together and because of this you find out that there is very the chance of vibration in a four cylinder engine is much less than in a three cylinder engine and if there is vibration while you are idling in a four cylinder engine it would have mean that something is definitely wrong with the the four cylinder even if you should activate some form of load in the four cylinder engine and you find out that there are vibrations while you're activating the load something is definitely wrong however with a three cylinder engine um, you find out that if you activate a load what should happen is that there should be a slight vibration and after the slight vibration it should immediately just disappear and the reason for that is because this three cylinder engine is operating on just three cylinders and because the the power stroke takes longer to occur in this three cylinder it means that the engine have to rotate a little bit longer before the power stroke happens and what that is for this engine is that whenever you activate a load while the engine is idling you will find a slight vibration but it should not be great what may cause a little bit more vibration is that if you activate the ac system while the engine is idling you will find out that you may have a little vibration but it should not be much and as the vibration comes on it should disappear immediately thereafter so for a three cylinder engine you find out that if you experience some form of vibration while you're activating a load that is normal but as i said before the vibration would have to go away immediately after you activate that load if it start to happen more and more frequently for example after activating the load and during the process of activation if you hold on to that device or button or whatever for that load to continue and the vibration keeps going on and going on you know that definitely something is wrong but in the event where you turn on that load and the vibration starts and then disappear immediately you know that something is it, it is okay for this type of um, engine as i've said before this type of engine um, operates on three cylinder and what it means is that the power stroke that propels the vehicle this power stroke takes a little bit longer to occur and because of this you will experience some form of engine vibration and as i said this is normal but it is only normal whenever you activate a load and the the um, vibration occur immediately and then disappear very soon after but if it continues you know that you already have a problem and you'd have to find out what cause or is the cause of that problem all right so hopefully this video is of uh, some assistance to you thank you for watching please subscribe and have yourself a nice time